Welcome to this video demonstration of the new multilingual web translation technology developed by the Machine Learning and Language Processing Research Group of Universitat Politecnica de Valencia. In this video, we'd like to show you how simple it is to add automatically translated versions to any website by using our technology. This here is the MLLP transcription and translation platform, which we invite you to visit in order to open your own account if you haven't registered yet. In the left-hand menu you'll find the web translation option. Here you can click on translate a new website, and then you just need to input the URL of your website, select the original language of your website, and then choose which languages you would like it to be translated to. So, we've just started our website into the platform. Now the platform gives us a single line of code that we will include in the header of our website. This line of code makes it so that our website will request from the MLLP platform the translated versions that we are interested in. Let's see how it works then. This here is the MLLP website that we just registered into the platform. In order to request a translated version, we will add to the address the code hash lang equals and the two-letter language code. The first time we request a new language, the MLP platform will take a short time to generate it. This is a one-time process. The translated text will then be stored and served immediately for subsequent requests. So, after a short while, we reload the page and here is the translated version in Spanish. We can browse through the website as we want, as all sections will be translated into Spanish. There is only one thing left for the webmaster to do, and that is to add a few buttons so that the website's users will be able to access the translated versions. Here's the Catalan version. Here's the Spanish version. We can also see the way it's showing in the address bar. And then we can keep browsing through other languages that are served by the MLP platform. So, now we have an automatic multilingual version of our website. But what if there are any mistakes that we'd like to correct in the automatic text? Well, while browsing the website, we just need to press a shortcut in order to activate the post-editing interface. We will be asked for our personal password. And then we will be able to click on any text in the website in order to edit it. For instance, we can edit the text for this Spanish translation. And when we save it, this will become the text that will be shown on the website. We at the MLP think this technology makes it very simple to add multilingual versions to any website, so if you are interested, don't hesitate to ask us about it.